Here we go again, back with more Pro Cycling Mania Season 2015. Today is the second to last stage of Trenatico. It's Monday, and after, of course, yesterday, where we didn't have a stage, it will be pretty exciting to get back to some uh, hill stage today. Tomorrow we have a final, I think it's a short time trial, but it's not looking so good for Rigoberto Uran after the last couple of mountain stages. Hopefully we can gain some time today and maybe get back into the battle for top 5. That's my goal for right now. So in the beginning of the race we of course have to protect our captain. It's a hill stage. I don't really know who my second best hill rider is. Uran with 78 is of course the captain. It's probably Simon Clark, Famolo or Villela again. Villela seems to be pretty good yesterday so I put him on Uran. And then we'll put Formolo, who's not been the greatest so far, on Simon Clark. And those two, Uran and Simon Clark, will be my two captains today. The rest of the team will uh, work in front of the peloton. I think I'll save Koren because I'm pretty sure he's actually pretty decent on the hills as well for later on. Yeah, he's a good all round rider, so he can get bottles and probably last for a while at this stage. We'll put him around the middle of the peloton and we'll pick Uran and Simon Clark and put them. Where can I right click somewhere? Okay, that's pretty weird. There we go. Put them somewhere around here. Not too far front, not too far behind. That seems like a good position for them to be in. And yeah, let's go to the end of the stage. Okay, last 40 of kilometers and it's been a crazy stage. I, w I wish I could have shown you all of it, but I would really recommend if you download the database and then drive these stage because it's so much fun. There's so many steep hills, so 20 plus percent hills all the time. Right now, land actually seems to be really weak today. He seems to be struggling. He's been sitting up front for a lot of today. And Sky will have to work for him right now as well. He can't seem stronger, but right now he just has to close the gap up here, which he probably will, because it doesn't seem too impossible that he can close this gap up here. Uh, one is pretty tired already with still 40 kilometers to go, so the, I can't really tire him out too much yet. Lilla and Clark are working the, the last parts of them off just to uh, help Uran as much as possible. Vanavamart hanging a bit over his wheel right here. He's dropping off as well. I think he Vanavamart is done. I actually thought he was going to be the strongest. My prediction for win today is, is Dan Martin. He seems to be by far the strongest of all the riders in the Pelson right now. So I would not be surprised to see him. And I get caught a bit behind some of my teammates here maybe. Oh, uh, what happened? Simon Clark seems to be done for today now. Just put him down to 50 or so. Lopez Sagan. I'm pretty surprised that Peter Sagan has managed to stay so far up in front of this race. But he's a strong rider. We have Roy Costa now coming back with Silbert and Villela also on. I'll just get some water while Silbert passes the group here. Can I get the water or what? Okay, there it goes. Just get some water to Videla as well. Might as well do it with other rising down the Pelton so they don't die at first while I'm not paying attention to them. You can see people are spread all over the map here. It's been like, look at all these black sections all throughout the day. Half of the Pelton fell off in the very first climb just because of how steep it was. But now we're only like 10 riders or so left. Where am I even? I'm even looking at the wrong group. One is all the way up here in a completely different town. So, 10 men in the front group here. I have Villela actually still with me. But it might as well not count because he's so tired right now. I'd actually probably just let him fall off. And let's save his empty for another day. Same with Simon Clark down here. He's done his job, but there's not much else he can do right now. Right now, I'm sitting as far up as possible. I know there's only like two climbs to go. And I could save empty because there's a long flat bit here. But uh, why am I not? There we go. Put him back. Why can I not right click? I'm, I have a guy selected. Okay, we got joined by six or so more riders. Can we little protect Uran maybe? Just for a little bit here. I know some of the riders behind me are going to save up India. So Landa has probably joined us as well, hasn't he? Where is Michelanda? Has Michelanda completely thrown this race away? It, I think Michelanda has just thrown away the race on the final stage today. That's pretty bad for him. Obviously, I didn't see any way he could lose this race, but he sat up in the front 
of all the climbs, having no one protecting him, and now he's paying for it. For now, Matt is not here as well. There's a, a lot of big riders caught behind. We can take Rolanda is is down here. Roy Costa is in front. With Martin, is Conti is here. Aru is here. So I'm not, I don't think Landa's going to lose six minutes to me. So I'll have to drop one of Visconti, Aru, Martin, or Roy Costa if I want to get that top five finish, or at least close to it before the final time trial. It's going to be difficult. I'm not ready to tell you that. But it might just be possible. Matthews and Terrence having trouble to stay on, maybe. I don't really know. Now starts the first part of the last line. Then Martin Sagan, Silbert, Visconti moves. Aru joins. Roy Costa doesn't move. I'm staying on Roy Costa's wheel right here, it seems. Kelderman, Lopez, Hesedal, Van Broek. The Okay, Greenheads guys have fallen off now. They're, they're done for today. I'm sitting behind uh, Fabio Aru here. Aru seems to be tired now as well, though. That's one more rider maybe out of the question now. But there's two clumps to go, and I have no idea left. I could lose a lot of time at the end of this stage. Hesedal moves back with Aru here. Van Borg on my wheel as well. It looks like a top 10, 15 place, maybe. Not exactly sure where I'm actually situated right now in the Pelzon. Stuba, Giesink, Rui Costa, Kelderman, then Martin Sagan, Silver and Visconti are looking to be challenging for the win today. I'm actually not too far behind, I'm actually in the, in the front group, that's pretty amazing considering I have no India left. But there goes Silver and Sagan and no one, no, no, then Martin is not following them this time. He's sitting still here with Rui Costa. Hesedal is sitting here. Aru is losing time. This could be good for me if I can stay ahead of Aru for the remainder of this stage. This could be really good. Gain about a minute or so on him. Matthews, Lopez, Simon Terrence. It's a gear. Villela is actually still sitting really far up front. Where? How far back is Michelanda? He's all the way back here sitting with Formula of all people. Formula actually have a lot of energy left as well. Simon Clark. I put him on around 85 here. Let him go by himself. Try the same with Famolo, 85 by himself. The little last game some energy as well. Uran is of course tired as, as who knows what because he's sitting here trying to follow the wheel of these guys. Histidal has done as well, has the same small amount of energy left. But there's a time trial tomorrow. I'm looking right now at a ninth place finish probably. Sitting with Rui Costa, which is surprising to me that I'm able to stay with him. But I think everybody is so tired right now that no one has any energy left. Hesedal will take a 10th place finish. Matthews, oh, Aru is coming right here. It's not that far behind Aru right now, but he's tired as well. I think he has Lopez to help him out. Last kilometer for the front group. I think Visconti, oh, Sagan is of course a great sprinter. Sagan will take this stage in front of Philippe Silver and Giovanni Visconti. Fourth place would be a battle between two quick step riders and Kelderman in the white jersey right now. Uh, but I have to worry for myself at the moment, I think. Uh, we are about a minute or so ahead. Then Martin takes it in front of Kelderman. Steve, I take sixth place. Across the seventh, Giesink eighth. I'll take ninth. He said I'll tenth. I think this is good for me. Yeah, I think I gained a lot of time today. I think. Um, I don't know. actually know if there was any riders behind me who overtook me here. Kelderman, how far is he behind? About a minute. Did I lose a minute to Kelderman? I probably did. What about Giesink? A minute as well. Oh, could be really close, but that's the five finish. I think we're going to see a lot of riders inside a minute or two here battling out for top five and tomorrow's time trial. But I have good time trial sets, so I'm sure I can take it home. And with this result, I not only jump up top 5, actually overtake 2 riders because I think Michelanda just lost so much time that he's completely out of the top 5. He's down to 8th place, he drops 9 minutes today, 8 minutes to uh, Ben Martin in front now, he's now the new leader, 34 seconds ahead of Rui Costa. Rui Costa is a lot better time trial, so we could see a battle in the last 10 km time trial we have tomorrow. That's a really exciting conclusion. Visconti seems to be pretty set on finishing third, no one really he can overtake in front of him and I'm far behind, 4 minutes behind in 5th. We have 3 riders inside, 12 seconds here battling for 4th place. Uran, of course me with 76 time trial, 75 prologue tomorrow, 72 for Aru and 76 for Kellerman. Kellerman is actually a great time trial rider as well. 
So it'll be, it'll be really close. Of course, I have some practice to do with a lot of other riders here. Lella and Simon Clark are two other riders. With Formolo in top 25, we have four riders in the 25. Great team performance overall from Garmin today. Not Garmin, Canon, the pro cycling team. Puts it up to second in the team standings. Musta, of course, first. Young riders, we're looking at second with Lella. Strong rider here today. I haven't really heard of him before, but he's done really well in this race. Better than Formolo, for example. Points, we are in 15th with Uran. In mountain classifications, we are up to 4th, I think, with Rigo to run. Rui Costa and Mikland, of course, with all the mountain points in the past mountain status, are probably going to take... Yeah, there's no more mountains to go, so Rui Costa will win this one. And yeah, that's it for today's state. It was a really fun state to drive. A lot of big percentages today. And we ended up getting exactly what we wanted, a top 5 finish. Let's see if we can hold it in tomorrow's time trial. If you enjoyed the video, please remember to like and comment and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.